We were really able to um, live out and see lived out the uh, school verse, uh, living peaceably with all. There was uh, 13 of us plus our leaders, and, and then being able to just go around uh, tons of different places all over the country, uh, different villages, different uh, cities, just being able to talk to people there, sharing peace with them, them sharing peace back with us. I know one guy, he shared his story and he's been battling different diseases and sickness all his life. And so after he shared, a bunch of kids came up and we're just hugging on them, just kind of sharing that piece back to us that we had been sharing to them the whole time. I think the most immediate, like the biggest challenge that stood out was definitely the, uh, the language barrier. When you're uh, ministering in a third world country, it's good to provide needs and provide food and supplies and all that. But what you're really looking for is that kind of connection and relationship and more so to try and bring them closer to God and let them see God through you. And that's definitely a lot harder um, when you can't speak their language and they can't speak yours. I'm taking Spanish 3 this year. I know some Spanish, but it's still hard to communicate and especially they speak it just so fast. I think it was like the second day we were there. Um, we were in a, one of the villages and I sat down in between a bunch of the kids that were um, there and they were like doing songs and different stuff that we always did every time we went. And I couldn't really talk to the kids because I want, like, I like introduce myself and stuff, just kind of basic communication. But right after they let us out and one of them grabbed a soccer ball, put me on the shoulder and like automatically, we didn't need to be able to talk to each other. We just started kicking around and we got a bunch of other of his friends and we just played for like almost an hour and a half. And then they had a time where they just invited a bunch of guys up and they said, we have a team from America here and you've got to know them and they're gonna come up and they're gonna pray for you guys. And so our team, we just kind of went person to person and we were praying on them. And I got this, the group of guys that we were playing with, and I got, we kind of got them huddled together and we we're just praying over these guys. And I'm praying in English and these guys start praying back in Spanish. And I, it just kind of felt like all language barriers were kind of just eliminated, like God could use me to just speak English, pray over these guys, and it almost seemed like they were receiving it, and like I knew they were. So I think that was the coolest moment for me.